Welcome to the 50,000 subscribers special. I asked you guys on the community post to ask me some questions, which I would be answering in a video. But before we start, I will first answer the questions asked by my Patreons on my Discord. And if you haven't already, check out my Patreon where you can join a close Discord server and get other things. Link will be in the description. What is your main source for information? Are you planning or doing research at museums? I mainly use sources I can find on the internet. I try to find sources that are either official or made by some reputable people. I also use a lot of books for research, as many as I can get my hands on, since the authors usually already did all the hard work. Not saying that they are always 100% correct, but they are useful. I currently don't have access to museums that have information that would be useful for my research. But later this year I'm moving to the capital of my country, so hopefully I will gain access to some good info. Any interests in other military hardware? Well, other than armored vehicles, I'm quite interested in small arms, and I watch a lot of forgotten weapons and in-range TV. I'm also slightly interested in attack helicopters, but I currently don't know much about them. I don't know if this is relevant, but I'm also interested in late medieval warfare, and especially equipment used at the time. Where are you from? Can't you see in the about section of my channel? I'm from North Korea. How old are you? I don't want to say anything specific, but let's just say I'm in my mid-twenties. Do you have any military experience? I don't. The army where I live is not exactly top-notch, and I have never been interested in serving under such conditions. If I lived somewhere else, maybe I would have, but right now I have other plans in my life. Why did you choose the name Red Effect? I don't really know. If I remember correctly, my cousin made some YouTube channel and called it No Effect, and I basically copied him, and since my favorite color is red, I basically mixed those two together. But it was a long time ago, and I haven't really thought about changing the name. What do you think about War Thunder? Personally, I think it's an okay game. I wouldn't be sponsored by Gaijin if I thought the game was bad. Sure, it is grindy, but you have to consider that it is free, and they need to make money somehow. No one is forcing you to give money, but it makes the game far less grindy. I'm playing the game myself and, as I said, I think it is pretty fun. Of course, it is not really realistic, but it is closest to what we can get and still maintain the arcade feel to it. What do you think the next generation main battle tanks will be like? Will the advancement of AT systems change doctrines and how main battle tanks are used or built for? Also, do you think main battle tanks will ever become obsolete? I think that currently autoloaders seem to gain popularity even in western countries, many vehicles started receiving them. But I'm not sure though, I think a lot of countries may consider similar designs to Russian T-14 Armata, but they also may improve on already existing designs. Also, I don't think main battle tanks will become obsolete anytime soon, currently there are a lot of advancements in active protection systems, so anti-tank weapons, especially older ones, are becoming less useful against them. Do you like potatoes? Hell yeah, I like potatoes. Which kind of potato or food based on them do you like the most? Really important question. Well, I would say oven baked ribs and potatoes. What's the most beautiful tank in your opinion? That's a tough one. I would say personally that it is T90M, but I also like STRV 122 because it is chunkier than German Leopard 2. What tank would you go into battle with? If I was to go to battle, I would like to return alive from it, so it would definitely be T-14 Armata. What's your personal favorite modern main battle tank? I don't really have one, my favorite ones are M1A2, Sep V2, T-90M and Leopard 2 A7V. I like those three pretty much equally, but my favorite tank of all time would be T-80 UK. No reason, I just like that tank. How is your situation due to this pandemic going around? Good, thanks for asking. Do you build models, my friend? I used to build models, but I haven't built one in years. I just didn't have enough of a free time to devote to building one, but maybe I will in the near future. What's your favorite tank or war movie? I don't really know. Fury, as unrealistic as it was when it comes to combat scenes, in my opinion, it is a good movie. I also like Black Hawk Down and Panfilov's 28 Men from more modern ones. But I would say my absolute favorite war movie is Stalingrad from 1993. 
What type of earth do you believe in? Flat, round or square? Uh, chair. What sparked your interest in tanks? I honestly don't know. I was interested in tanks as far as I can remember. I remember playing old 2D strategy games which had tanks, and then a big turning point was the release of the original Man of War game, where I used to do all kinds of things with tanks in the game's editor. Then World of Tanks came and it all just went from there. In your opinion, what is the best modern main battle tank? Depends. As a single unit on a technical level, it is definitely T14. However, because of its low production numbers, I wouldn't say it's the overall best. For a country that has a big military budget, I would say it's M1A2 Abrams. But if we are talking about a country with small military budget, then I would say T72B3 because it has the best price to performance ratio. But I still don't really like that tank. Do you plan to cover military equipment other than tanks and infantry fighting vehicles? How about aircraft and ships? Not in the near future, planes aren't really my field of interest. Ships, kinda, but not really. Also, what do you think about the USMC getting rid of its M1s? I think it's a good idea for what they are planning to transform the USMC into. That is all for now. I'm sorry if I didn't answer some of your questions. There were hundreds of them. I tried to pick the most popular ones. I will be back to my regular content next week, so I will see you guys then. Have a nice day.